feeding your dog raw diet. This is a question that I often get, which is, what is feeding uh, a dog raw diet? How should I do it? This is a video for beginners. I'm going to explain all the details that you need to know to get started into feeding your dog raw diet. All that and more coming up. Hello dog lover, my name is Sara. I'm a dog trainer, also coach dog owners. In this video, a beginner's guide to raw feeding your dog. I'm going to explain briefly all that you need to know about raw diet and all the details about feeding your dog raw diet. So first of all, what is raw diet? What do we mean when we are talking about raw diet, feeding our dogs raw diet? Raw diet is basically feeding your dog raw meat. Many people eat raw, not particularly raw meat, but raw food and vegetables. But in this particular case, we're talking about raw diet for dogs. Raw diet for dogs is basically feeding raw meat and some raw vegetables and some raw ingredients here and there. So why do you want to feed your dog raw diet? In general, raw diet is the most natural species appropriate diet to feed dogs. Kibble or dry food is not a natural food for dogs. It's not a food that they crave. Kibble or dry food turns into carbs. Carbs in, turn into sugar, which is not necessary and not natural for dogs to have in the first place. So lots of dogs nowadays are developing diabetes, inflammatory conditions, and arthritic conditions not necessarily just because of the frequency of eating is what they're eating. Uh, most dog food is composed of 46% to 74% carbohydrate in the form of corn, wheat, and other grain. Kibble or dry food is processed food. is prepared using high heat, which is killing all the nutrients in the food. It lacks moisture, which dogs really need that moisture from their food that they're getting. Many food manufacturers add synthetic minerals and vitamins to the food, which the body of your dog can't use it. So in general, there's no good reason to feed our dog kibble or dry food. I have done a recent video about this topic which I'm going to link it here, you can go ahead and watch that to learn more. Basically, feeding your dog kibble or dry food causes toxins to develop in your dog's body. And raw diet is opposite of feeding our dogs kibble or dry food. It's toxins free. It is actually natural, healthy diet for dogs. Many of you wonder if there is a risk or danger of feeding our dogs raw diet. There is no risk or danger if you do it properly, if you prepare it properly. Just imagine when you're preparing a chicken dish, for example, how do you prepare it? How do you go about it to season the chicken, raw chicken, and you store it in the fridge or use it to barbecue or cook? The same procedure you have to take when it comes to feeding your dog raw diet. So basically, uh, there is no risk feeding your dog raw diet. The opposite side, kibble or dry food, there's lots of risks and danger when you're feeding your dog kibble or dry food because it has tons of toxins in it. So how much do you want to feed your dog when it comes to raw diet? Basically, you find out your dog's ideal weight in pounds and then multiply it by 10. It gives you an amount that you can feed your dog that amount. So let's say you have a dog who's 20 pounds. The ideal weight is 20 pounds. Time 10 comes 200. So your dog should be eating 200 grams of food per day. That means 200 grams of intake. So what do you feed as a raw diet? Basically 75% of the raw diet is meat, any meat, any type of protein, whether white or red meat, and 25% of it is raw vegetables, green leafy vegetables. So how do you get started in feeding your dog raw diet? Basically you can start 
all of a sudden you can transition to raw diet if you feel comfortable with it. If you don't feel comfortable with it, for the first week or 10 days you can cook that meat and slowly transition to raw meat. But in general, raw meat is so clean and safe and pure. No risks that will cause your dog to develop any problems. The first few weeks of transitioning to raw diet is very important because your dog's body is going to go through detoxification, which is going to have diarrhea, throwing up, uh, maybe skin rashes and things like that, which is a good sign that means your dog's body is being detoxified, which is a good sign, so I wouldn't worry about that. One more thing that you want to consider when it comes to transitioning to raw diet is making sure that you're providing enough proteins in form of meat, enough green leafy vegetables which helps with digestion, and also essential supplements. Basically, the essential supplements are omega oil, vitamins, and maybe probiotics or prebiotics. These are the things that you can learn later on and add them to your dog's diet. But one of the best things that you can do is just changing your dog's diet from kibble or dry food to raw meat, raw diet. You can start by purchasing your raw meat from your local grocery store uh, and then move into more intermediate level which is basically purchasing your uh, dog's food, meat and raw meat from your local pet store that specializes in raw diet. One of the things that you want to notice is that your dog, if it's having soft stool or diarrhea, those things are going to go away when you switch to raw diet. Your dog or puppy also is going to have less poo and pee as well. If you have any questions, leave those questions in the comments area. And if you need more information about this subject, make sure to watch my other videos in this playlist. And until next time, have fun with your dog.